Hi everyone, today we're going to be taking a look at Dragon Quest Heroes, The World Trees Woe, and The Blight Below. Well, we're going to take a look at the unboxing of the Collector's Edition, which was exclusive to uh, the Square Enix shop online. Look at all these goodies. Ooh. So yeah. There we go, that's the lovely little box. So, I came prepared today. Scissors and a knife. Because sometimes, ew, gosh, those are dirty. I don't do it, and then I have to edit the videos and all kinds of stupidity. So today I figured, no, we're gonna do this the proper way. Now I know this video for a lot of you is probably late. Uh, that's because we've actually had a ton of footage, uh, footage, a ton of features going up and a lot of different special stuff. So I wanted to, uh, you know, space everything out. I got the window open, so it might be a little on the loud side. Sorry about that. So anyways, here we go. Dragon Quest Heroes! You see that? Someone even, uh... All right, what do we got? Uh, all right. I don't plan on selling this, so I don't care about the box. Ooh, fancy. All right, that sounds like there's a truck outside. All right, so that's the outside box. Now the inside box is pretty cool. It looks like a little treasure chest. If this was Zelda, when I open it, it'd be... Dun, 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 dun. No, what am I saying? That's, uh, that's Final Fantasy's victory theme. What the hell is wrong with me? All right, so let's open this bad boy up. Boom. Uh, any sort of paper and stuff I'm gonna pull off camera just because I in case there's like codes or something So you get a Dragon Quest Heroes keychain, which is basically just a little slime that uh, Dragon Quest Heroes print is actually on the paper itself So that's cool Nothing uh, overly fancy I'm gonna take this. I don't know what this is It's a paper. Look at that. I guess it was supposed to hold all that together doing an awful job. Here is the plush, which I love. That's going to go up on my wall. Bunch of codes and stuff for nothing. Okay, whatever. Oh, cool. So it does say Dragon Quest Heroes on it. Very cute. Nice little slime. And I'm going to just pull this all out so that you guys can have a look. We don't need this. So we have a slime, we have the box itself, which is kind of cute, a little thingy, obviously. Oops, I just hit the camera, sorry about that. We have the game, and I think it was Steven, which is the other guy who helps me on the channel here, for those that don't know. He mentioned last time, hey, you don't actually open the games. I think it was for Metal Gear Solid or something like that. Um, there are actually, I just thought of it, there's no codes on this particular game. Because I believe they emailed it to you, or I was wrong. Yes, I was wrong. Okay, so let me uh, do this so you guys don't see everything. So here's the game itself. Day one edition, whatever that means. PlayStation exclusive content. I could have sworn they also emailed me with some, some stuff. I'm not sure, but anyway. So this is what you get in the collector's edition, which obviously I'm going to not show you guys because I don't want someone to steal the code. And then you get this little booklet here, or is it a poster? Ooh, I think it's a poster, yeah. Or not. Okay, it's just a thing with all the different characters and their stats and stuff like that, so that's kind of cool. That's kind of neat. And the last thing we have that I've got to show you guys is this little thing right here, which I don't know what this is. I'm not opening the slime right now or the other thing because I just don't need to. Oh, it's a lanyard. Yeah, it's a neck lanyard. Cool. So there you go. I can be... Uh, can be the envy of everyone at work with one of these. So that's pretty much it. Nothing uh, overly fancy. Nice little collector's edition. I thought it was pretty cool. 
And, uh, well, that's pretty much that unboxing. So I hope you enjoyed, and, uh, well, I'll be back soon with another video.